What's up, everybody? It's your boy Corey, aka GQ Saint. Back where you back, nah, tongue tied. Back from the reaction video. This is basically USC. This is well, another MMA Studios video for the upcoming fight between Kamaru Usman versus Leon Edwards, aka Edwards versus Usman. Three. I ain't gonna lie, I watched that fight, man. Usman was winning that fight, but that upset, you know, anything could happen. I'm glad I did not bet money on that fight. I was going to be out a hundred bucks. So yeah, so let me double check because pretty sure it is this weekend. Hold on a second, y'all. I gotta check on my phone right quick. there yep the 18th so that's this Saturday so definitely not going to pick a fight pick a who's going to win this fight going to kick back and enjoy the fight yeah but like I said that was definitely in my opinion that was definitely one of the biggest upsets of the year for USC so like I said come on who's he was winning that fight but that kick you never know what might happen. You always got to stay in your toes and try, do your best to try to finish the fight. Definitely don't let it try to go to the judges because, you know, always the judges always don't make a, the best decisions regarding, you know, picking a winner. But let's go and dive on into the video. You already know a special question. Have a comment below. Let me know what you're at to. Let's get it. Yeah. Anything is possible in this sport. It's what makes this sport the greatest sport in the world. What a night. It looks yeah, like he had that belt so much time. The, waning moments of this fight. the old saying, but Leon Edwards out getting that belt this can be the easy part. Keeping the belt is the hard the part. Fight. How was Edwards able to pull this out? Every single day he woke up, it was this streak, this Anderson Silver streak. It was this pound for pound number one after the yeah. box, like even some of the sponsors are not around no more you get to a certain point to where people start putting expectations on you i try not to be bothered by anything that's going on Kamar usman has dominated this division for so long that if anyone deserves an immediate rematch it will be him he beat tyron woodley yeah he dominated that fight against tyron Covington. yeah he stopped gilbert burns jorge masvidal that this knockout horror, you're like, whoo! That is the consequences and the those sweat, all the sweat looked his face, man. Oh my goodness, you have to have these moments. That is what dreams are made of. Do you know what I'm saying? I couldn't do it. Do you know what I'm I couldn't do it. Look at me now. Leon Edwards, he did this the long way. He took the long path. The last time he lost was back in 2015, and the man he lost to was Kamaru Usman. He was the better man that night. He forced me to improve, he forced me to get better. Leon's gotten a lot better since their first fight. And so is Usman. Yeah, so he was gonna him. go down as the greatest of all time. I think Leon originally won a boy in Masters all, world. but... Hmm, so what I don't know. does this all mean for the welterweight It's cool division. that Usman brother now is in the USC now, too. Has relinquished this crown to Leon Edwards. It means that we got a third fight. New welterweight champ, Leon Edwards, makes his first defense. Edwards gets to defend the title in front of his home crowd in London. And oh, yeah. Usman goes into enemy territory looking for a Yeah, match. this did for a lot of attention. To show these guys why I am enemy the best in the world. You know, to your opponent's home. And he's Earth. got a champion's mentality. What Leon Edwards said, I have to remind everyone of who I am. For me, it's a dream to come back to the UK headline. I am the best in the division, and I cannot wait to prove you one more time. I am going to make this be whatever I want it to be. Each and every time I step into that octagon, from start to finish, my job is to dominate. Pound for pound one. Pound for pound one. 
There is no power for power. That's it. Guess what? It's not done. This time, I'm gonna finish your ass. It is a fantastic fight, and we are finally here. They are coming to absolutely destroy one another and leave them in a pool of blood, and I cannot wait for it. There's gonna be a whole bunch of trash talking. And no glove touch neither, because they even touch gloves in the fight. Yeah, definitely looking forward to this fight. So, going to see a buddy of mine doing a fire party. We might go to a sports bar. Okay, that was a very good video. So, anyway... That just goes to show you never know what might happen in any type of you know combat sport like that. Any upset can happen. So you be dominating, but you can't get too comfortable. Then I'm talking about like waiting to the last round, but yeah, cause like I said, any upset can happen. So probably he didn't see that coming. That like, oh man, cause even I saw that coming a little bit. Cause I see that combination. He he do that. That's one of his main combinations he do. Cause I see him doing from uh pad drills will edwards doing pad drills up there for that kick so yeah definitely got some power to it we, we know now he's just gotta know what to expect but don't be too reliant he's going through that move again just focus on you know trying to dominate but still don't well he got a great card he ain't gonna be you know gassed out well yeah so i'm gonna kick back and enjoy this fight so anyway i always respect the leon so I think, like I said, I think he won a Jorge Masvidal, but I don't know. Given the legal situation, you know what him and Kobe Covington got in Kobe. Yeah, I think he said he tore up Kobe. He lost the fight and the uh, and the octagon, but in the streets, definitely in the streets in Miami. Oh yeah, then Jorge beat the crap out of him. So anyway, drop a comment. Let me know who you think is gonna win this fight. Make sure you give a like, comment, and subscribe. And fantastic day or evening. Peace.